I don't think apprenticeships are promoting enough in schools. I think it should be focused a lot more on apprenticeships. University places are focused heavily on, and I feel as if, fair enough, university is a great thing to go to, but I don't feel apprenticeships are focused on enough, because speaking for myself, I've excelled 10 times more than I would have gone to uni, and I think apprenticeships should be focused more, funded more, and just really a more key point, I feel. In schools, apprenticeships, when I was there, they weren't really promoted that well because it was everyone had to go to university. Uh, I do believe now they are promoted a bit better than they were, but not at the level that I feel they should be. At school, apprenticeships were promoted at first. I was thinking about going to university until a school event came and seeing that company advertising apprenticeships and learning that you can earn money while learning a trade. It's, it was a kind of no-brainer, the fact you're going to have a job guaranteed at the end of it as well, that it's a great chance to get started and get a trade under your name and after your apprenticeship you can go anywhere and, work, anywhere and get a job and you've no any other issues. I feel that apprenticeships aren't promoted as much in schools, it's more university, but you know, apprenticeship is the way to go. I think an apprenticeship is a better option if you know what you want to do at the end of it because you're learning as well as getting that vital career experience because if you've got the same qualification as someone coming out of university you've got say four or five years experience in the industry whereas they've got none. Yeah, I think apprenticeships are better than university. It's, I've seen that many people come out of university with great degrees but there's no work there for them to do, where in an apprenticeship you're getting, a, getting to work and learning a trade and you've already got a company to work for that most likely nine times out of ten do keep you on after your apprenticeship so you're guaranteed a job without having that worry of coming out with any university debt and stuff like that. It's, that's kind of tipped it for me. After completing my apprenticeship I'd like to work for 30 years, give or take, buy a rocking chair, get old and retire. That's it. That's all I want to do. <laughs> After completing my apprenticeship, I'd like to off, um, try to help out my family a lot more because I've got a lot of family you know, growing up. Hopefully that I'll be able to open the door for them and show them that it's all about studying. Once I finish my apprenticeship, by then I should be a full-time fitter. After completing my apprenticeship with Oldens, I'd like to move up the company becoming a foreman and then overseeing multi-million pound jobs. After completing my apprenticeship, my plan is to work my way through end systems. So currently I'm classed as an intermediate engineer. So it's then go on to a senior engineer and then hopefully go into commissioning management. Uh, this will be done working through my commissioning grades as well, which will take me through the company to the higher level, which I want to reach. Well, I found that visa training, looking it up and going through it was the best option for me. With my manager already going through visa training apprenticeship and where he's got to now, it's shown me that maybe if I get, if I do well, I can achieve my goals and my dreams. I think people should choose uh, visa training because they are a great provider. They really focus on your progression, you know, how you're doing with the course, how you're getting on your work. They're constantly checking how you're doing at college work everything else, they're, just, they're really good in that sense. They're just really caring, you know what I mean? Visa Training is one of the very few providers that actually provide training in multiple areas. So you don't have to do much if you want to change. So if you come in with the idea of I want to be a plumber and later on you, you decide you want to be an electrician with the experience that you have, you can still go with Visa Training. It's, it's an all-inclusive, it's, it's a no-brainer really. Visa training is really good for doing an apprenticeship because if you ever need anything to do with portfolio or college work you can phone up your training advisor and they give you an answer as soon as they can. I think visa training really helps you reach your goals and help you balance work and college life. You should choose visa for an apprenticeship, it's, they give great support when required and you never have any issues, if anything, any problems they're only a phone call away and they always keep on top of you. And make sure that you're doing the best that you can do.